Hello, everyone. It's my honor to introduce myself to you. My name is Giles, son of Eight, goddess of mischief. So, you may be wondering, what is this all about? You've never heard of me before, have you? Well, let's just say one pretty boy locked me up one day, but I think he just let me out. So, I hope you enjoy my little story. Stay tuned. Boop. Man, I really need some help. My, how am I gonna get all this reputation off of my back? Why did I think of that? Giles. If. No, no, no. no. <laughs> well, I could. Should I? I mean, if I release them. Hmm. I mean, let me see. Charles has been in here for a while, but. Maybe releasing them. I can implant them in the camp and maybe everybody will forget what happened. No, 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 that's too dangerous, but should I? Yes. Uh, no. You, oh, no, no, no! <laughs> I can't no, 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 I am out of that stupid lamp. <laughs> Giles, I need you to give me your lamp right now. You need to go back. I've been a grave... <laughs> Mistake, no, you need to go oh, back inside. Oh, what the little the, the thing you captured me in. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm out, buddy, and I'm out forever. <laughs> I'll make sure to put this lamp in one of my portal holes and just let it float in nowhere for a while. <laughs> no, so... Giles, that wasn't, that wasn't me. That was Evil Brian. You need to give that back. Who? Uh, evil Brian? <laughs> You are the same Brian I know, you know, son of Aphrodite. You, you you are still the same. You aren't lost a few bolts in your head, are you? You're still not yes. mad at me, are you? <laughs> mad? Well, obviously. I thought there'd be a reason you caught me out of my lamp to hurt me or to send me somewhere else. <laughs> it's just... Uh, okay, just give me back the lamp, okay? That's not no, funny. No, 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 no. I think I'll keep it. Besides, I've been trapped there for a bit too long. I need to catch up on what the world has to offer. What have you yeah. been doing, Brian? Beautiful as well. Ever. Oh, thanks. Uh, I guess. Um. Well, when you first, or I should say, last saw me, I wasn't quite myself. It wasn't really fully who I was. Me. Do you remember that purple sword I held? Yes, I do recall it. The seductive rose. <laughs> that, uh... It changed me a bit, and... I, uh... I became a monster. And I'm not proud of what I did, but... There's just a lot of things that went on, and... I thought maybe if I released you, maybe the tension would uh, back off of me from the camp, and... Oh. Yes, Giles. Yes. What? What is... What is... Oh, just a toy. <laughs> yeah, uh... I get bored. <laughs> right. I guess... Uh, I guess I can tell you what happened. Sure, sure. Give me some exposition. Well, I, uh... I killed my... Now yes. ex-boyfriend. I killed one of my best friends. Oh, really? Who was it? Uh, Cake... Kayla, the snake lady. Oh, oh. The counselor at the camp. Really? You killed the council? Wait, we're in a camp? What? What? Where well, no, am we're, I? We're, no, we're, you're, you're, we're not in that camp right now. We're in my estate right now. Oh. Or I should say my mother's estate. Oh, we're at, the, you're at, we're at your beach home. Oh, my, this, my summer home, yes. Yeah, okay. All right. That I remember. <laughs> yeah, of you're course you remember. Oh, don't be mad. It was one time I tricked you to wear you... Speedo. Come on. <laughs> <sighs> well, you also threw that demigod party without my permission. Ah, just just one little flare. It wouldn't hurt you. Besides, seems like you don't need my help anymore to get in trouble. It wasn't me. It was the seductive Rose. Come on, consumed I... Consumed me. 
I whisper in someone's ear, and everything they know turns to a disaster. A sword whispers in yours, and you kill the counselor? Who really is the bad guy? <laughs> but it wasn't me. It was the seductive rose using my body as a vessel. I'm not You don't know what it was like. I'm not here to blame you, and I truly don't care about the people who died. So I'm just glad to see you. I haven't seen you in so long. Oh, is this your pet? Can I eat it? It's... No, of course you can't, Giles. That's a... No. no you cannot. Fine. If you eat that, no. You will... I'll put you back in that lamp. Oh, okay, okay. Just calm down. Calm down. It's not like you hunt the lamp anymore. Can't even believe you found that dang thing. Trapped me in. How heartless do you have to be? I am your buddy. I am your pal. You would say we're close friends. <laughs> okay, remember, I like I said, it wasn't really me. It was more of a seductive rose at the time. Of course, I still like look like this before I turned completely evil. Oh, God. Oh. There's just a lot you don't know. Sure, why don't you feel me in? You say there's hmm, more people here? Hmm? In this uh, camp? Well, yes. It's the other demigods are in the camp. But... Oh. Do you tell there's more gods here? Who? Tell me. Anyone interesting? Um, well, there's my sister, uh, Bree. The si oh, my sister. Your sister? Daughter of Aphrodite. Wow. What? Absolutely not, Giles. <laughs> that will never happen. Sure. I don't know where she is, though. And then there's the son of Hades, Zylo. Ooh, really? The son of Zeus, Mario. Ooh, okay. Uh, the son of Poseidon, Mitch, and the... Uh, actually, no, it's... Jakey. Um, uh, who else? Uh, son of Hermes, uh, Colin? Right. I think there's new people coming in. There's new other pantheons, but... Something that you probably don't know since you were in the bottle is that... I released the Titans with <laughs> two other people. <laughs> What? Oh, it wasn't me. It was evil Brian. It wasn't. Me. It was a seductive rose. So if I go outside, pick a rose, and I start setting fires, I get to blame the rose. <laughs> Buddy, oh. you're a bit unhinged. Have you missed me though? Have you? Really? Have you missed me? I missed you. All the years I spent stuck in that lamp get you a crick in the neck. How about we have some fun? What kind of fun are you talking about? No, oh, well, there's only two types of fun, if you know what I mean. <laughs> that the type right. uh -huh. that uh, involves some clothes, and there's other fun that involves people. How about this? <laughs> I'll help you. You seem to release these titans, and people probably want you dead, am I right? Very much so. And that is such a cruel thing for someone of such beauty. You're the son of Aphrodite. You should be more respected to these people. Not like me, a common jester. But you, you're someone. You're the someone you should look up to. What's someone that? they should look up to? Someone they should respect, of course. <laughs> if you use me, you release me for a reason. With my help, well. But know. it was on accident. I didn't, I, I regretted it. Everything happens for a reason. Well, I, I know. Destiny? I, and I can see it within your eyes. It was your destiny to let me go. Just like it's our destiny to have them under your feet. My feet? They treat you like a criminal. But, I mean... They should praise the ground you walk on! But they have a right... They, rightfully so, they can! I mean, even though I didn't mean it, the seductive rose used me as a vessel. So, of course, they blame me. It's understandable. But, Brian, you, you're a god. What right do they have to judge you? None. You remember back then when I would do those tricks on people? You remember when you got bit by yeah, that those snake? Those cruel traps. 
Oh, come on. Yeah, I did not like that at all. <laughs> I mean, that's the reason why I'm in the lamp, but let's not get confused. Well, let's get real. There was other reasons, of course, besides <laughs> that snake biting me. It's true, I was a jerk. However, I've had time to think about it, and... You know me, Brian. I'm a sucker for someone with brown eyes. I don't want to see this happen to you, and you need help. I'm your Are you friend. flirting with me? Oh, you would know if I was flirting with you, Dottie, be in bed. <laughs> Don't oh, be so coy. Uh, okay, okay, what, what can you do to help me then? Well, you say you need new friends, you need respect, you need the power that you used to have, the glamour, the glory, all the riches of the sea, just like your mother I mean, was formed from, the foam of the ocean. Uh, right, I mean, they did say that wherever Aphrodite went, a war followed. And trust me, wherever I go, mischief is at hand. Tell me but who. Tell me yes. one person. And I will make sure they revel in your name forever. Wait, what are you going to do? I'm not going to do anything. They'll do it all themselves. Just tell me. Come on, you could use a buddy. Come on, you have a pal. Dude, the way I see it... Me and you, we can beat it. And I can stick around. So if you help me where I can tell you and you tell me, maybe I can get you what you want back. It's worth a shot. What do you get out of this? You this is a trick. Me. Why would I trick you? You're too smart for that. So Am I? Am I smart enough? I'm the one that took a random sword from a stranger. I lost my wings, my control of myself. Who sits at that throne? I don't, I don't deserve to. Does someone else deserve it? Do I deserve it? Do they deserve oh. it? Who is the son of Aphrodite? Who? Me. I am. You're the only one who deserves to sit at that throne. And they deserve to worship you. Don't they? But they're my friend. I, I can't be like that, though. You don't have to. You're charming. You're intelligent. You're smart enough to know that without you, I wouldn't be here. And the first thing I could think of when you told me all of this was... I should help the person who's helped me so much. I mean, even before this, me and you were quite close. Not even in that other way, but we were still close. <laughs> right, right. Um... Come on. What's the worst that can happen? Your reputation's already in the trash. And if they hate me, there's no more room for hate in their heart for you. Let me so, go. What should I do? Well... Let me do my job. Keep focusing on what you want, and I'll be right there whispering in your ear. I'll come uh, back. I'd... Okay. I'll go to this camp. I'll f meet some people. Make a new friend or two. And tell them how generous you've been. I'll tell them how you've changed. How the glow in your eye hasn't left. And that how you're so remorseful. That you released me. Even though I didn't deserve it, you showed me grace, mercy. I do that, so maybe they think different from insulting. You would do that for me? Oh, for you, Brian, I do a lot more. Right. <laughs> um, I guess that could work. Of course. Every good god or king needs a jester. I didn't really think about it like that, but Someone if you trust. think that I can get my friends back with your help, then I'm more than open ears. Then I'll do my best to spread the good news for all you. Tell them that you're back, that you're pretty as ever, and that you're being so kind to me. Uh, thank you so much. This camp, I assume there's gods of all origin there yes and i think this year there's going to be other gods from other pantheons 
Asian, Ooh. Polynesian, and Egyptian. You're getting dicey. New faces means new credibility. If they all love you, there's no room for the others to hate, because they will be in the wrong. I'll go take a visit to the Asian side of this. I'll see you later. Boop. Oh, sounds good. Remember, Brian, this is the start of a new future for us. Right. Uh, thank you again. See you soon? Of course. <laughs> Helios. I know, I know. Did you hear all of that? Oh, well, that sure was a quick teleportation. But I guess when you have my power, it's not really that big of a deal to go here or there. So, this is what Brian was talking about. <laughs> son of Aphrodite, more like the son of a dumbass. <laughs> Cannot believe he fell for that. At least I'm not stuck in this stupid lamp. Lamp of Giles. I'll show you what I think of your little lamp, Brian. I let it sink to the bottom of the sea. Maybe your mother can find it if she's ever going to show up again. <laughs> Goodbye, you stupid prison. Hopefully no one has to go through that. No one deserves to be forgotten. <sighs> but I digress. Brian has done something for me. Beautiful eyes. Chiseled abs, but a harder sister. <laughs> Oof, things seem tilted. Hmm, I'll deal with that later. What's important is I've made it. No longer will I be the jester under everyone's feet. With Brian's help, my goals will be realized, and I'll set all of them on fire. <laughs> now you must know who I am, Dor. Giles, son of eight. So please, if you know what's good for you, open. Oh, hmm, interesting. Dawn just opens. Just opens up. Oh, closes too. Hmm, I like that. That's pretty neat. Yeah, this does look like the area I would be in. Hopefully no one minds if I take a look around. <laughs> so many exotic statues. Which one should I mark first? Oh, I also hope Brian doesn't miss his candlestick and his magazine rack. What is he reading? Oh, that sly dog. I didn't even know they had min versions of Playboy. <laughs> oh, nevertheless, why can't I fly? Well, I'll deal with that later. Seems, though, that nothing really changes. Gods are still wanting the admiration of each other. Silly little things. They should know they really don't matter. But I'll find myself a home among them. Hopefully then they can realize how futile it is. Oh, an unclaimed one. Seems pretty neat, but not my style. Let's see if I can find one a bit. Oh, what is this? Son of Aphrodite, Brian. <laughs> Hope you don't mind, buddy. More like... Son... Well, no, I'll put my name. Giles. Son of... Eight. There we go. <laughs> Much better. Oh, so let me just decorate real quick. Got a magazine rack. And my candle. Hmm, and a rug. I've never had one of these before. This is so amazing. Well, well, I guess that's good for my first day on the town. Hopefully Brian doesn't miss his few knickknacks, and I can pay a visit to these Asian deities. <laughs> Hopefully I'll make my mother proud. <laughs> Thank mm -hmm. you.